Today we have a way different episode. We found two Humvees, H1, straight military. We found these at an auction. This oh. had a gun turret in it. Look at the hole in it. Oh my gosh. So basically we were gone and these guys uh, dropped these off. We haven't even had a chance to look at them. <laughs> That's how the window works. You got to be kidding. So we want to go through, first we got to make sure they start. And uh, we want to go through and look at these things top to bottom. Wow. It's, oh you, my God, look at this. You think this thing went through a war? Oh yeah. Oh man. See how many miles? 1581. 1500 miles. That just shows how many vehicles the military has. You just have to find them. So this one, oh it does turn. This one's a four door. Oh! Sucker fired right up. Holy cow! Why is everything hanging? I wonder. I don't know. What is that? Oh, it's a blinker. The blinker comes off. No. Hold on. See if we got brake lights. No. No brake lights. No. I wonder why they got the exhaust up in the air. That's for driving through water. Holy cow! Okay, Brad. Look, this has the old high beam foot switch. Look, you so push us for high what beam. What year is this one? Uh, let's see. This one is. So here's the catch, Dad. How many months ago did we buy these? Oh gosh, this has been like six and a half months. So six and a half months, and we had to go through some kind of uh, government background check. Not sure why that sounds kind of scary. Because I guess they don't want nobody just taking and selling these to oh. some. I don't know whether it's. You know, I, don't, I have no idea, but but I didn't even know we were going to get them, and they didn't tell us they were even dropping them off. Yeah, so we bought these things like a little over six months ago. We just saw pictures online. We didn't know the condition, nothing like that. So obviously oh. one fires up so far. This what? is a 2014. Uh, this is a 2014 Humber. With 14, 1,500 miles? Gosh. Here's what I want to know. Do you guys like the four-door H1 better, which is this one, or do you like the truck version? I personally, I like the, I like the OG. Oh. Oh, I like so the OG. This one, I didn't think it had doors. The doors are in the back. No way! Are they, are they fiberglass? This is so sick, guys. Oh, we don't have to buy doors. How cool is this? Doors are probably expensive for these, huh? Oh, yeah. Nice! So, what is all this? These are all over them. I don't know what those are. See? Oh, yeah. Best part about this build? The BFGs. Oh, it's not starting? No, maybe we jump it. I think this is a 24 four build. Yeah, Holy least... cow, look at the size of the alternator. That's not the alternator. Yeah. Why? It's a generator alternator. It's 24 volt. Look at 28 volt. Oh. 200 amp. 200 amp, 28 volt. I've never seen an alternator that big. Look at the setup on these. So this, these are both diesel, right? Dead? Yeah. Wow. This is fun. You know what's fun about this is uh, seeing just uh, what the military, uh, you know, this is this is straight from the military. So this is a vehicle that I don't know when they used it, but they're full on using it. And what's fun for us is I don't know exactly what we're gonna do with them, uh, but we wanted to get them and have fun. And, and I'd like to, hey, door. I'd like to uh, fix that one up. Maybe put like a KC light bar, put some uh, way better BFGs on there. And I don't know, make it cool, maybe paint it flat black. I don't know. But this is, woohoo. We're gonna try and get that one started, but look at this, you guys. Oh my God. Full on turret. It's crazy how wide this is. This is like 
I mean, imagine normal car. I'm not even close to the passenger. I'm gonna make sure there's no snakes in this wheel. All right. This is fun. So we're gonna get these things running and uh, we're gonna go drive one around town. Oh, look. That door don't shut. Hey, if we get this one running, you think we could just go drive them around town? I think so. Let's try it. These are freaking insane. Man, we should probably check the oil and stuff. Oh! Oh man, that one's loud. Why is it so loud? 1,300 miles. 1,300 miles. Where does it show that? Wow. How cool is this? Power steering sounds cool. Oh. Power steering's low. I think we're gonna do is we're just gonna check all the fluids and then uh, we'll take it out. But how cool is this? You guys literally get experience us taking out military Hummers for the first time. This is unbelievable. I love, this is my favorite one. I love it. Ooh, we got a loose hose clamp right there. It's a coolant line. And that hose clamp is broke. I'll go grab a new hose clamp. We're gonna go ahead and throw on a, uh, a new hose clamp there. It's on the low side, but it's not fully warm. Oh, okay. It's there. Can you see the power steering pump? Because that other one is squealing bad. I don't know. There's hoses all over the place. Uh, I bet that's to the windshield wiper fluid. Or Man, the windshield this is wiper. That's scary. We've got a lot to do. Now yeah, but these are awesome. These just got back from who knows where. Can we find out where they were? I don't think so. I think the gauges and stuff are very similar to the fire truck. We'll take this thing out. That's convenient. Just throw that on the ground. You think? Hey, that is kind of funny that they have the exhaust at well, high. Another door up here. There's a what? This must be to a different vehicle. Oh, I bet it is. Look at how sick that is. This is so freaking sick. We're going to take you guys in the military home right now. Oh my, look at how far you are. I love this thing. So this is a full on mount right here for a, a turret. That's what that used to be. Whoa! Oh! They're all done with air. How could, can you see out of here? No. Oh, you guys, this is so cool. I just love that there's a huge hole where the turret used to go. I mean, that's a heck of a sunroof, huh? This thing is sick. I just wonder, it's like, where was this thing? It rides really nice. Got a lot to do. I mean, does it go down the road good? This thing cruises. Oh! <laughs> good, where are you going? I don't even have a seat. <laughs> Everything's flying. So this thing will just crawl like nobody's business. And this is all four wheel drive? All wheel drive. Dude, how cool is this? Oh, it's... Okay. <laughs> 
along in mountains and crap. Up so these things, they're, 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 I mean, they're meant to just like be on crazy inclines and stuff, huh? Oh, you can go almost anywhere. Does it have an incline meter? Oh, easy, easy, easy. <laughs> Dead. Dead. wrong with you? Why are you hitting them all? I'm not meaning to. <laughs> let's start thinking of what we could do to this. Hey, let's get the BFG out and let's go do some of the trails. Oh, and go off-roading yeah. in this? Take both of them. All right. Wow. That is so cool. Well, all I know is, uh, man, my dad and I, we got our work cut out for us. We're uh, stoked to really show you guys what these things are. And again, I don't know if they were in war, what war they were at, what happened with them. But all I know is uh, they're pretty awesome. So on the four door, I want to start on that one very first. And I want to see what we could do to it. We'll take them through rivers, go trailing. This is now our, our third military vehicle we own, including the fire truck. We should invite a bunch of people when we go. So yeah. Whoever wants to go, we meet on this trail and we'll go hit a couple different trails all over. What, what we're thinking is we want to take the Hummers and uh, we're going to download the BF Goodrich uh, On Trail app. And it's an app that shows trails all around the world. And uh, we'll actually be able to live record as we go through. And you guys will uh, be able to drive on the trails if you're ever in the area. But we'll go through and document just going through trails and see what these things actually could do. I'm um, again, they're uh, Hummers, especially H1s. These things are like bulletproof. So I bet they go through anything. But we got we got trails we got to go do. And then we also got to fix them up. So uh, we'll keep you guys updated on all that. But I will tell you, the next episode is uh, of the C10 Slayer. And uh, we've been uh, out of town filming a Motor Trend TV show. And uh, that's actually this car right here, which I have yet to show on the channel. I'll show you guys that one here pretty soon, but uh, the C10 Slayer is just looking killer. I, I don't even know how to explain it, but it's, it's just unbelievable. So all I gotta say is thank you guys for watching. Have a blessed day. Don't forget to uh, show some love on the channel. Throw a like or a comment, or if, if you like this video, you know, to give me your honest feedback. All right, better guys.